my name is Vishnu doing MPhil from Kohat University of Science and Technology. First, uh, today I am here to present my topic in International Brain and Biomedicine Conference. The presentation topic is Isolation of Hydroxyapatite from Fish Bone for PAG based nanocomposite when prepared by photo cross linking. Hydroxyapatite, hydroxyapatite, the chemical formula has been widely studied since 1926. Hydroxyapatite is naturally occurring mineral of biological importance. Human and animal bones are composed of hydroxyapatite. Hydroxyapatite is considered as biomaterial widely employed in many health applications. Because of its chemical property, hydroxyapatite exhibits a great bioactivity and is highly compatible with the adjacent bones and teeth in living beings. Heart tissue restoration uses HA in many ways, although not in its purest form. Pure HA has poor mechanical quality that make it unsuitable for load bearing application. To broaden its application, HA is typically added to composite or polymers. Polyethylene glycol based material are widely studied for biomedical application due to their beneficial qualities such as durability, minimal immunogenicity, and easy to use. Hydroxyapatite has been utilized in dentistry to replace missing teeth. Along with dental cement and filling, toothpaste also include HA. The use of HA in medicine delivery is another instance. HA is a strong candidate for use as a drug carrier because of its inherently porous structure and high binding affinity, which creates a niche for drug loading. Nanocomposite, the application of nano, uh, uh, HAP nanoparticle or nanocomposite are wide as discussed earlier. However, it was observed that the stability, mechanical and physical properties of HAP based materials can be enhanced by combining it with PAG. Objective, the objective of this Presentation is isolation of hydroxyapatite from fish bone for PG based nanocomposite film prepared by photo cross linking. Experimental work first of all, we uh, separate hydroxyapatite from fish bone and then we use in clinical application. Isolation of hydroxyapatite first of all, we separate uh, bone from fish and then after treated with chemicals and after we that uh, separate uh, uh, through calcination process and we separate hydroxyapatite. Isolation of hydroxyapatite for the alkaline hydrolysis procedure, the bone of rumu will be boiled for 15 minutes at room temperature to completely remove the meat and the fish bone will be treated with sodium hydroxide at 250 degrees centigrade for 5 hours to ensure the organic moieties are properly removed. Once the pH neutralized, the mixture will be filtered through a filter paper using continuous water washing at 250 degrees centigrade, the product will be dried in the oven. Fish bone will be put in silica crucible and heated to 1900 degrees centigrade in a muffled furnace as a part of the thermal calcination. PG based film prepared by photo cross linking. To prepare blank film, algae cure will be added to PEG DMA. At the same time, another film will be added algae cure in PEG DMA and add hydroxyapatite nanoparticle in solution and kept it under the UV light for 3 hours. The cross link gel will be formed after UV light. The gel will be kept for 2 hours in ambient temperature to completely solidify after the gel will be washed with distal water. Characterization for confirmation the synthesized hydroxyapatite and pre prepared film will be evaluated by FTIR and XRD. FTIR result. Change in chemical composition of hydrogel with and without our, um, HA were determined with FTIR. FTIR analysis of PEG DMA was performed to characterize and confirm the chemical cross linking among the different PEG DMA hydrogel after free radical polymerization. PEG DMA mixture before polymerization, the largest number of carbon to carbon double bond resulted in the highest absorbent peak in the spectrum. After UV polymerization, carbon to carbon bond, which disappeared during the curing process, making the success of the free radical polymerization reaction carried out and the absorbent peak disappeared because of the conversion of the carbon to carbon double bond into carbon to carbon single bond. XRD result the hydrogel without HA and had only one broad peak with addition of HA, the height of the this peak significantly decreased. It indicated the presence of HA crystal could interfere with the packaging of the PEG DMA based polymer chains and result in decreased crystallinity in composite scaffolds. Uh, thank you very much.